Ferry, downtown Flint back to normal after four days of back to the bricks. And this year's success is already prompting questions about next year's cruise. ABC 12's Gabe Gutierrez is live on the bricks, Saginaw Street, with our continuing coverage. Gabe? Bill, as we mentioned at 5 o'clock, city officials had to shut down part of the festivities on Friday because there was just too many people. Next year, organizers plan to close off more side streets. An exact head count is tough to come by, but it's safe to say this year's Back to the Bricks crowd shattered all expectations. Uh, my guess is about three times what it was last year. The lunch studio sure didn't mind. When I grew up, it was like that on Saturdays. I mean, this place was jammed with people shopping. Mike's Triple Grill sold out of food Saturday. Brown Sugar Cafe almost ran out of milk. A potential disaster for a coffee shop. Well, Wednesday and Thursday was the rolling cruise. There was a lot of spectators, but they were more out there to watch the cars going up and down the street. But then Friday and Saturday, as the cars parked, got busier and busier. So how will organizers top this? We're going to have, have probably more of the large exhibits. like Jerry Preston heads up Flint's Convention and Visitors Bureau. For him, bigger is better. He wants to attract more national vendors like Mother's Polishes, Waxes, and Cleaners who made its first visit to the Bricks. There's even talk of some sort of partnership with Detroit's Woodward Dream Cruise. So I think they, they complement each other, frankly, and, and, and don't really compete against each other. And, and maybe we can do some joint promotion. At least we can mention Woodward Dream Cruise and Back to the Bricks in the same breath from now on because we're, we're moving up to the point where we're quite well recognized. And that partnership would be an interesting one, especially since many out-of-towners we spoke with said they preferred Back to the Bricks because it wasn't as crowded as the Woodward Dream Cruise. Reporting live in Flint, Gabe Gutierrez, ABC 12 News. Heard the same story.